I am so disappointed. I did not get my scooter five years ago when I first moved to Tianjin. So today I'm making up for lost time and I'm jumping on the scooter to show you more of this magical city. Today we're cruising the streets. Yes, we are also running into horses, grabbing coffee, and sharing more of my life here in Tianjin, China. Hey everybody, it's John Thomas and welcome back to my channel. It is one of the most beautiful days in Tianjin I have seen in so long. And I cannot wait to go out and explore this absolutely gorgeous day. But it's 9.30 and we had one COVID case this past week in Tianjin, which means that we all need to do a citywide test. Now that citywide test started at 6 a.m. and my building has not been called yet. The systems are down, I'm hearing they're crashing. So I decided I'm gonna go shower, get ready for the day, and then as soon as I can get my COVID test, I'm gonna take you out and we're gonna see what this day has in store for us. Because on the scooter, anything's possible. Okay, I was just getting ready and the alarm has gone off. Some of you, this might feel like you're living in the olden times, right? Like you don't even have to deal with this COVID situation anymore. We have one case and we're sounding the alarms and we've got to go test. So I'm going to throw on my flip flops and head. Oh, my speaker is, my projector is speaking to me. So I'm going to throw on my flip flops and head down to um, do my test. This is always the toughest part, waiting for the elevators because the whole building's going at the same time. COVID test is complete. Let's go outside. I got my car keys. I don't have a car. I have my scooter keys. Let's go. So I brought you to Wu Dadao. This is a really special part of Tianjin. Wu Dadao stands for like five avenues and it's a place where like lots of old historic buildings are. It's a place where there's a lot of restaurants, coffee shops, and just a lot of people come to hang out. So I thought I'd bring you here on our little adventure today. Also, you're in this plant that's like got a ton of flowers, purple, Very, very cool. I am craving a coffee, so we are gonna try to find one of these local coffee shops. Oh God, a horse. <laughs> All right, let's, uh oh, I don't think I did that right. There we go. 
Let's go get some coffee. Another horse. Did you know you were coming for horse content today? I bet you didn't. I bet you didn't. But here I am bringing you more premium content, more horses. The small coffee shops in China are unique and fun. Although I am a huge Starbucks fan, I'm so glad shops like this still exist in some of the small cultural pockets in the larger cities across China. Hey everyone, good to see you. Some of them are eclectic as you see here. Some are themed. This one was all about photography. I have a video on that if you wanna check it out and some of them are also very modern, like the one I'm visiting today. Here I am at True Man Tap House and Direction. I found it along the streets here today, so let's grab some coffee. No coffee, no work. Well, I ordered myself a Bing mixture. Here it is. It tastes really good. I'm sorry I didn't give you the first shot. I was on a phone call. But, and here it is, so, so good. I am so excited about having my scooter in my life. I am completely disappointed in myself that I did not get a scooter earlier in my time. There's so much freedom in grabbing your keys and getting on the scooter and going wherever you want, whether that's the work, the grocery store, or even showing you all around Tianjin on this absolutely gorgeous day. So many possibilities. It's incredible. I did drop it though the other day. I was leaving my parking area and somebody else was coming in and I turned the wheel too quick and I slammed the brakes and it was sandy and I slipped and I had put my feet down and the whole thing crashed to the ground. So it does have a couple of scratches now, but that's okay. You know, it is what it is. I'm having so much fun with it. It's giving, <laughs> so not only am I giving you premium horse content, you're also getting premium scooter content. Could you ask for more? I mean, yeah, washing machine content the other day. Just keep bringing it. <laughs> so it's the next morning and I am so happy that I went out yesterday because today is cloudy and overcast and nowhere near as nice. And do you know how I confirm that I had an incredible day yesterday? This amazing sunburn on my arms from the ride. I have a farmer's tan. I was on the bike all day and I just enjoyed the last half. I wasn't filming the rest of it. So I hope you all understand that I just wanted to ride and that's what I did. So thank you so much for watching the video. I really appreciate you being here and I will see you in the next one. Bye.